Hi, I'm Dinesh Krishnamurti, Assistant Professor at the Technical University of Eindhoven. And in this talk, I will present a computationally efficient distributed optimization framework over distributed systems. Now consider a distributed learning problem where we want to learn a common inferential model using local data sets across multiple worker nodes. Alternating directions method of multipliers, ADMM, is a simple yet powerful decomposition coordination framework that allows one to decompose such problems into smaller subproblems that are coordinated by a central server. ADMM requires the subproblems and the master problem to be solved iteratively until some stopping criteria is met. In other words, every time a local node receives updated information from the central node, it has to resolve its potentially non-convex, non-linear optimization problem whose difficulty increases with the size of the problem. Repeatedly solving the subproblems can quickly add to the overall computation time. This can be challenging, especially if large number of iterations are required or in real-time decision-making problems, such as distributed MPC, where ADMM iterations must be solved within the required sampling time. Heterogeneity in the agents in terms of the local processing power and data size also implies that the CPU time per iteration is dictated by the slowest agent leading to what is known as memory locking. Research efforts have been predominantly aimed at reducing the number of communication rounds between the master and the subproblems. Although these are very important developments in the field of distributed optimization, the computation burden of solving the local subproblems itself still remains. Noting that at every iteration, the only change in the local subproblems is the information received from the central node, the local problems can be viewed as parametric in this information. By doing so, one can exploit parametric sensitivities to reduce the computation time of the subproblems from one iteration to the next. In particular, we show that by using the solution obtained at the previous iteration, the parametric sensitivities can be exploited to cheaply evaluate the approximate solution to the subproblems at subsequent iterations using a tangential predictor. This significantly reduces the computation time of each ADMM iteration. In the simplest case, this would involve solving only a system of linear equations as opposed to a potentially non-convex, non-linear programming problem. Under certain assumptions, it was shown by Fiaco that for parameters in the neighborhood of an already existing solution at PIK, there exists a unique continuous and differentiable uh, solution manifold, which is a local minimizer of the subproblem corresponding to the different parameter values. Now we can linearize the solution manifold around the current iterate, where if we can compute the sensitivity, which is given by the partial X by partial P, we can then cheaply approximate the solution to the new parameter value. Using implicit function theorem on the KKT matrix, sensitivities can be obtained by solving a system of linear equations, which is the tangential predictor. The accuracy of a tangential predictor depends on the problem Lipschitz uh, properties as affecting how much the problem changes iteration to iteration. The approximation error on the optimality residual can be controlled to a desired accuracy by adding additional corrector steps. We demonstrate this on a distributed learning problem where we want to train a neural network to learn the optimal policy using expert demonstrations, which in this case we assume are obtained from different robots. We first solve this using standard ADMM, which is shown in blue, and we can see that this requires around 5,000 seconds of CPU time. Then we solve using our proposed sensitivity-assisted ADMM with only the tangential predictor, which is shown in red, and the CPU uh, time per iteration, we can see, has now reduced by about five orders of magnitude. And this has resulted in the overall learning problem uh, requiring less than 20 seconds as opposed to 5,000 seconds. But this comes at the cost of uh, the approximation error on the optimality residual, which in this case is around 25. We can further enforce a tighter bound on the approximation error using additional corrector steps, which follows the standard ADMM iterations closely, but at a significantly lower computation time. This clearly shows the benefit of our proposed sensitivity-assisted distributed optimization framework.
Our proposed sensitivity assisted distributed optimization also has a broader impact on optimization problems arising in several areas such as distributed learning, real time control of multi agent systems, flow routing problems, optimal resource allocation, to name a few, all of which can be formulated as a distributed optimization problem and solved efficiently using the proposed sensitivity assisted distributed optimization framework.